Hey YouTubers, it's Mark from Truth Seeker, and I'm in Seoul, I think it's 679, um, but as always, I'll give you the link in the description, and let me tell you, it's just incredible. I mean, look at this statue. You see the base that comes up? There's some type of face on it. What's in this photo is absolutely amazing. What they're trying to cover up is just hilarious. You see the structure of this building? And you see it's got something that comes up here. There's the entrance to it. You can see they blurred it too. It's a lot easier for them to do in black and white. Can you see how they cut this off up here? You see that? But you can see they this fake whenever you see this you know it's fake this fake sky whatever I don't know what you want to call it but see how they cut the, this straight line when you just look at the regular picture you're not going to notice this but you could see where the digital imprint see it comes up as a see how that just shows, comes up see how they cut this off this building you could see the parts of this building that keep going up See, here's like some type of dome part of the building. And you can see more parts of it. You can see back here, it looks like it came across, and there's pillars one, two, three, like four pillars holding it up. You see that space right there? Right above the hand. See how close I can get you in there and hold it steady. You see? right above that hand you could see there was an open area with one two three like four pillars holding it up All right. that's not even the best they really gave us a good one here you see this open area here looks like there's some type of craft or something you can see it's got like legs holding it up you see what's there on that like white white area then you come over here look at this statue that they tried to blur out I had to play around with the uh, the contrast and the brightness because of course you know what they do on these black and white pictures you see the structure back here see the opening then it comes down you see the two openings here Goes out. This goes back. They see it's all this fake skyline. See how they cut that line and just put it right in there. It comes to this open area. And you see the structures. Let me just. These pictures are so horrible. I mean, it's hard for me to even get this out of it for you guys, but sorry about that. And you come over here. This is the best. This is this is the craziest thing I've seen in a while. This is just cool. Sorry about the flickering. Just getting used to using this new screen. You see this ball, the cylinder, and then there's another one right next to it. You see how it's got like one, two, three, like three windows in it. See that? Sorry about the flickering. Then you can see the structure back here. See these structures? What comes up? See this? These ridges? See this thing that comes up and it's all carved? One, two, there's like 
three or four uh, points on it. And you see the structure back here. It's crazy, right? There's nothing going on on Mars. We're all nuts. See these structures that are standing up? See the shadow? That to me looks like a statue of some type of being or human standing up and you can see the shadow coming across. That's how far away these pictures are taken and then they just crop them. There's more buildings in the foreground. Sorry about that. See how they just put that flare. See how they haze all of this? See, to me, some of these look like poles coming up. Trees. See this building? See the dome on the top of it? See, the closer they get to Mount Sharp, this is the stuff that they're trying to hide. The problem is, is there's so much. I mean, you can see there's walls. You see the wall here? Then there's the little entrance, then the wall continues. There's some type of symbol here. And the wall continues along. You can see here's the roof of the building. There's a little dome. Sorry about that flicker. I need to get a hand on it. You can see here's more of the building. You can see openings and doorways. See how they put that haze over it? So you can really get a good look at it. You can see the different color of the roof here. See how the roof line comes across. You can see the entrance, the windows, the doors. There's all types of buildings up there. It's just, you know, what this big secret is about. I have a couple of ideas, and you know, everybody else has their own take on it. Right now, I'm not going to get into that. I'm going to let you enjoy these beautiful buildings and structures. Because to people like us, this is what makes my heart beat when I see stuff like this. Look at this cool dome. You can see it's got another part to it. Here you can see there's a, a huge, looks like a dragon's head to me. And then you can see all the stuff back here that they blurred out. That's not the sky, you can still see the digital like imprint. This just continues with the buildings and stuff. You can see there's an entrance to this building here. I said the past couple of days I've been on fire. I've been tearing apart some of these thumbnails, which is not easy. A lot of work goes into getting those thumbnails onto video. There's another circle here, looks like a stack coming up. You can see here's an entryway. Oh, like two giant pillars, more buildings. See all the structure back here. Look at this cool thing. It looks like it's, uh, I'm going to say, just like a cannon. I'm probably wrong, but it 
looks like some type of monument or something. Look at it. It looks like it's a cannon barrel on top of something. You can see more windows, entryways, whatever you want to call them. See, I believe these pictures are taken either from a high up vantage point or from a drone. See how this comes up. There's another entryway. See, this would be the roof of the building. This is the entryway. You would walk into this. You could see there's some type of like, it almost looks like a fountain in front of it. See, it looks like shooting up out of this. It's got a little hole in the center. You would, I believe you would walk into this garage or entryway and you would probably come up about halfway. That's the scale I think we're working on. But I believe that this is either up on a drone or high up on a mountain and then they just crop these. See this? There's like a flat platform with some type of statue or something on it. Over the past couple of days, I believe I've given you some of the best views of buildings, UFOs, crazy craft, you know, statues than it's probably ever been seen. It's not easy, it's a lot of work. Look at these entry, look at this entryway. Look at this huge wall back here. And some type of uh, ball or something in the center there. Look at this. Looks like a cup. another statue. This looks like a gigantic pole coming up. You can see the shadow on the back portion there. You can see this wall back here. There's a piece coming up. You can see the supports on it. It's another entryway. The cool thing is you can see like shadows and stuff. I mean, it's just amazing. I'd love to be just hiking around here and just, man. This pole coming up. NASA did a lot of work on these pictures. See this entryway? It almost looks like there's some type of uh, vehicles or something that are going up into it. See how perfectly carved that is? When I started to get into this, this black smudge they put here. When I started to get into this picture, I was, I had a double, double take. I'm like, you gotta be kidding me, NASA's letting, letting us see this. And you can see the different to see the different levels and the structures of these buildings. And then you can see the cutoff line. You can see there's even structures in the back here. 
but you can see the line where they just cut it off the digital line you see it right above those fingers you can see where it changes the color that's where they cut it all off. you can see the, the statue head here see how they cut it right off but they're not hiding nothing so you know if they would do that there's nothing they wouldn't do Look at this thing, it looks like a, it's got a shadow underneath it, I mean, <laughs> it almost looks like it's floating, so you know, it's got that perfect shadow. There's another entryway. This to me here, looks to be a UFO, I don't know what the hell it is, but it looks like it's something that could fly possibly, see? the shadow underneath it and it's got some type of tripod holding it up see how close I can get you sorry about that flickering I'm just really getting used to using this but it gives me a chance to really get you guys in here sorry and show you what they're hiding that's with screen capture I just cannot show you this stuff tried every screen capture there is. A couple of the companies were pretty cool and gave me my money back. A couple weren't. So what are you going to do? This little area here. See how it's different color than every other area, and it looks like there's something in the center. So yeah, they just come in and scribble around this, they blend it. See how they cover up these statues? That looks like a gray alien's head to me. That back there is really cool, that ball. Looks like it's got windows on it. Let's see how they just darken up that area. When you know what you're looking for, that those kind of areas, you're drawn right to them. As you know that they're, the way they're manipulating, Center screen. Look at the, how can you miss that? All right, guys. This has been a fun one for me. You know what to do. You can keep it up. Love you guys. And uh, enjoy this. And in the next one, I'll uh, I'll see you soon. I'll see you real soon. Two Seekers out.